as anyone would know who's ever owned an Apple freaking device, you cannot get the battery out. It is in there. Unless you break this damn thing open like a clam, your battery is stuck in there. Charge is right there. You can plug it into your computer, plug it into your wall, your car. Does not matter. Charge is pretty quick, and it lasts for like 300 hours, I think it is. It's nuts. If you're using your phone, it's six hours when you have your uh, 3G on. These do not do 4G, so boohoo for you. If you have 4G, upgrade your phone. Then you'll be alright. If you're just using Wi Fi, 10 hours. That's 10, that's it. One, two, that's ten right there. Ten hours. Ten hours video playback and forty hours audio playback. Which is true because when I'm at work, pop the headphones in, turn the cellular data off, and I lose, I think from, in like three hours, I lose like six percent battery. Which is not bad because then you just plug it on and break and you get it right back. It's pretty cool. So uh, it's got 20 hertz to 20,000 hertz audio playback. I don't know what that means. I'm not an audio person. Uh, yeah. Uh, here's some specs. I actually wrote these down for the audio because I don't know what they are. Um, audio format supported AAC 82320 kbps. Protected AAC from iTunes Store. HEAAC MP3 82320 KBPS MP3 VBR Audible blah blah blah. Okay, I'm done with that. Uh, AIFF and Wave. Yeah, let me show you something real quick though. Uh, when you get it, focus right there. You can get free music on your phone. I've done a video once on this. I'll do one specific to the iPhone, though, just so people know. So, yeah, you can get free music on there. It's okay. All right, so you got the video out. Supported up to 720p if you have the AV adapter or the VGA adapter. And then uh, it's 576p and 480p with the component AV cable. I used to have those and they look like crap. So don't go with it. Uh, funny thing is, on their website, Apple's website, it said for whatever reason when it looks when you talk about the headphones, it says Apple supported. Uh, I would recommend it, but you can use any headphones. I don't know, you know, Apple's just pimping its own stuff. I don't blame them, but damn, come on, Apple. But, you know, whatever. Uh, something else on their website has ratings for hearing aids. Um, yeah, whatever. No one really cares about that. Uh, your mail attachment support, it does everything. Don't worry about it. If you're getting something that it doesn't support, the, whoever's emailing you that crap needs to knock it off. It, it's kind of lame. It's got a gyroscope in it. It's a three-axis gyroscope. I'm sorry. Uh, it does not make your phone stand still. It doesn't make it perfectly balanced. So, yeah. You got the accelerometer, which I was showing you earlier. That's fun to play with. It's got a proximity sensor. That's pretty much uh, that little little dealy right up there. So when you put it up to your head, make a phone call, you're not pushing buttons with your face. Because that always sucked with the old phones. You know, kids, you know, these days, I say kids these days, I'm really not that old. I'm 23, but I'm just saying kids these days. I had a freaking Nokia phone, the brick with snake on it. Yeah, I was always pushing buttons with my face when I was on the phone. You know, I was there when LOL was invented. Kids these days, they don't know. That's my little rant, sorry. Ambient light sensor. I, I don't really know what that does. I've never noticed it do anything. You know? You need to have an Apple ID when you're using it. If you don't have an Apple ID, you aren't doing anything. No apps for you. You like all my hand motions that I'm doing? I'm like waving them all around. There we go. Oh, and screen turn. Oh, the focus at screen turns off. Whatever. Uh, operating temperature is 32 to 95 degrees. Kind of funny. Uh, I can't tell you how many times I've overheated this phone in my pocket while listening to music over like the Wi-Fi. It's kind of funny. 
And if you are buying it fresh out of the box, Apple box, not like at GameStop or a Pawn Shop or something like that. I mean, in the box, you get the iPhone 4, you get the headphones, you get the USB, you get the little bricky thingy that plugs into your wall, and you get documents. But what they don't tell you is you actually get little Apple stickers, and they're adorable. But you know what? I don't think I got them with my iPhone. I got them with my iPod. I don't know about the iPhone. Whatevs. It's awesome. So there's a little bit of information on the iPhone 4. I will be doing one on the iPhone 5. Dig it, 5. Right there, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. I will be doing one on that so you can see that. And you know what? Just for S and Gs, you know what that stands for. I'm going to be doing one on the iPad. This is the iPad 2. I'm broke. I got an iPhone 5. Now I got a new iPad. I don't need a new iPad. I don't want an iPad mini. I don't want a giant iPhone. Or a small iPad. You know, ain't nobody got time for that. That's right. Just did a reference. Alright, you guys. As you can tell, I'm getting tired and I'm just rambling now. So, you guys have a good one. I hope you liked the video. Don't forget to like. Don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to thumbs up. Check me out on Twitter. At I'm a Flork. Lately, I've just been tweeting vines that I like. So... If you don't like vines, I guess don't follow me on Twitter. If you like vines, I only tweet the finest vines there are. Check out my blog. It's I'm a flork at the yeah, I'm a flork .blogspot .com. There is a hyphen hyphen in between the Ima and Flork. So check me out on there. Thanks for watching guys, and you have a good one. Thumbs up. Thumbs up. Alright, bye.